Hey guys, so uh, ignoring all better advice from people who would know about this stuff better than me, um, I decided that my standing to pee aid would not be a travel mate uh, put into a mango because I wasn't really sure whether I wanted um, a packer like um, or a packy as some people call them but I tend to avoid that one because it has it is an unfortunate homonym with a racist term so, <laughs> so with a packer I wasn't sure whether I wanted one and they're sort of more expensive than I would want so the whole another hole, you know, put the hole in the packer and put the travel mate in it. I wasn't sure I could do it, so I thought that, you know, if I'm going to try standing to pee, um, I'd use something else. Um, one of these, I would not recommend this. Um, it is called a, a Shiwi. The clue's in the name, like the mango products. Um, sort of for girls, not really for... FTMs so it doesn't sort of do it properly. I thought that it would be better because as you can see it's got like a gigantic funnel. Now that'll catch everything that you, you do. Um, I really didn't trust myself that the travel mate funnel looked quite small. I mean I'm no expert on the thing but I really didn't trust myself. I've actually sawn a bit off of this about that much. So this is gigantic. You put this in your boxes and it pokes out. It looks like you've got an erection. It's not so great. Um, but you don't have to worry about that because it doesn't just stay in your pants. If you try and move, it just plops out. That can be embarrassing. Thankfully, I haven't used this out in public. Um, this is for like camping and stuff. I suppose the travel mate is as well, but it, it's, its use is really restricted. You keep it in your pocket, I guess. Like, uh, um, like I say, early days for me, I no expert in the matter. I assume that if you use a, a packer or one of the normal mango stand to pee aids, you would um I lost the thread of where I was going with that. I'll edit this out. Oh yeah, the packer will keep it in place, probably. Um and I don't really know whether this would. I mean, I'm thinking that if at some point I got a packer, I think online I was looking and there's something weird like £12. Again, feel free to correct me if I'm wrong. This is only four online, probably less if um, you didn't get it online. But I don't really want to be seen buying this. Um, I, don't, I was wondering whether if you actually put it in, that would in the packer that would hold it in place so it didn't just fall out and I'm wondering um, whether the packer and the whole thing would just fall out as well if it was small enough and you weren't wearing things tight enough please tell me because I don't know I'm there's quite a lot of space in the the leg of my boxes and these are 11 to 12 year old boys boxes so you know, I, I don't know if I can go any smaller than that. I'm 19 years old, but very small, um, which could be a problem, but never mind. Anyway, like, yeah, I think it, I still think it was worth it, but I've had a few slip ups uh, with it. Oh, I mean, it's early days again, as I say. So, um, yeah, a few wee accidents with dribbles and things if you'll excuse the pun uh, and also somehow managed to get a skid mark on my new boxes which hasn't happened to me in years um I can't think why that would happen all of a sudden any ideas I know it's a bit gross but what are you gonna do um yeah so Hopefully I'm just practice. I mean, it's nothing that I want a toilet roll, some stain remover, and just adjusting yourself a bit won't fix. But yeah, I might up upgrade at, at some point. Anyway, um, that's all I had to say about that. Any thoughts on that matter? And um, meet me back.